Well, we asked you this question a little earlier. Have you ever been so stressed or angry that you just feel like breaking something? Well, we're ready now. There's now somewhere you can go to smash and destroy any items you can get your hands or your sledgehammer on. Cor Harlan is live at the outraged Rage Room in Vancouver. And Cor, this is right up your alley. I know you don't get angry that often, but I know <laughs> some, sometimes you, you like to break stuff. Oh, you know, between but beneath the still waters, there's always a raging current going on here from outrage this morning in orchards. Uh, and and I, I was, I was, this is, uh, this is um, uh, Tara Gale. She runs the place here. You know, I was just talking with you a second ago. I had no idea that there were that many people that rageful <laughs> that they would come in here and just pay to smash stuff up, right? Yeah. And that's, that's pretty simple how, how it goes, right? Yeah. Well, who comes in here, and, and why do they come in here? Of all walks of life. We've had somebody as young as three, somebody old, as old as 89. It's just a cathartic release. You let it build up over the years. You just have it, need a place to, like, let it out. And just to be clear, just inanimate objects, no people, right? Yes, absolutely right. not. My we do have a punching bag. My but... wife had asked. <laughs> yeah. She wanted me to ask. Anyway, so you got a, you got a, you got a thing on here, right? And you sell, uh, you sell by the time, and everybody gets a bucket of yep. stuff, right, to Correct. come in here? And you can go over here, Carl, come over here, and you can go over here and pick out other stuff that you want to beat up a little bit, right? So there's a whole bunch of bottles, there's cutlery. Okay, yeah, you can probably step out here because I'll bake a, break a few things. Break a bottle, how fun is that? You ever just want to do that with a wine bottle? Bang, with a baseball bat like that. Bang like that. Again, like that. There is something about the sound of that that I just love. Now, for, so, if, so if you're not into bottles, right? Tara, you got you got you guys are onto something here because who has not had, say for instance, a uh, computer printer, for instance, that would not you could not find the wireless signal for, right? So they get these you get these things at the thrift shop, right? Yeah, and or Goodwill. we get them donated, or we just state sells everything. And you just lay them on the ground there if you want, and just hammer it. Oh, there is something that feels. About. Yes. Oh my God, that is awesome. That is for the computer printer that will not pick up your Wi-Fi yes. signal, right? And almost everyone does. And that's what's inside of a computer printer. Oh. All right, that's it. That's good. So that is outrage. You got other tools that you can use over here from golf clubs, smaller hammers, regular claw hammers, crowbars, but really, Jenny and Ken, nothing really gets it done like a sledgehammer. What else is there over here? Oh, I gotta show you something else too. How the mighty have fallen. Bob Miller, remember? Longtime Portland radio personality. I think he lives in Astoria or something right now. Mm -hmm. He's one of the things that they've got here to smash, and I'm gonna do him a favor and spare him this morning because I've always liked the Bob Miller, and I've always liked the Bob Miller bobblehead from Outraged this morning here in Orchards in Vancouver. If you wanna get involved in this, go where? To www.outragedroom.com, or you can give us a call at 360-326-326. 4470. Just Google Rage Room. Yes. Google there we Rage go. Room in Vancouver and you're going to be you're going to be good to go here. <laughs> Cor, I, I want to know uh, what percentage of people bring their own stuff to smash up. I mean, there are things at home that I'm frustrated with and I just like to bring it there and smash it up. So how many people actually do that? Ken wants to see it and know if you can bring stuff from home. Yes, we do have a BYOB option where you can bring 20 glass items of your own as long as they're not aerosol, light bulbs, and then you can bring a monitor or a, a printer. Ken, what do you have that's bothering you so much? Oh, man, I've got some old uh, cassette decks that don't work anymore, but they're taking up space. Oh, bring them. And uh, I, I just like to Listen, smash we'll be them here up. till 8.30. Okay. All right, that, we'll that be here till eight thirty. Bring them up here and let's get them taken care of. Let's get them taken care of this morning. Yeah, and for our younger viewers who don't know what cassette decks are, that's what we used to play music on before everything went digital. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> that's right. That's all right. right. All right. right. Thanks a lot, Cora. Yeah. That, that was fun. Time now is 5.52. You're watching Coin 6 News this morning. And coming up, a local car dealership is donating a 